Back speaking with Michael Baker this morning from Aravella on Just Stocks. Michael, morning. Good to have you back. Very good to be back, Andrew. Thank you for having me. Look, significant uh, bit of news from you in the last couple of days here. This placement, $12.5 million, clearly well supported. Tell us a bit more about what this means for Aravella and your programs and milestones for 2024. Yeah, sure. And, and firstly, I think just touching on that point, it was great to have a lot of support uh, and from a range of investors, but most importantly, some pretty sophisticated and institutional grade investors, which is excellent. So delighted on that front. And uh, for us and our programs, it is a huge step forward uh, for our lead product, Ella 101, which we're developing for CD19 positive blood cancers like lymphomas and leukemias. This provides the capital that we need to complete the necessary activities to take this into phase one and start capturing data. So for us, it's uh, it's very exciting and really looking forward to accelerating and progressing these, these things into clinic. And for our other programs, it also provides us with the uh, the bandwidth and, and capital essentially to, to progress the preclinical stage programs that we've got. Uh, for our L105, which we're using to tackle initially gastric cancers, but then also looking into pancreatic cancers. So really looking forward to getting some data out in the short and medium term. And look, you've had some interesting news this morning, a, a new addition to your scientific advisory board. Tell us a bit about Professor Gian Petro. Yeah, that's right. Uh, so Gian Petro is a phenomenal individual and really one of the earliest pioneers of CAR INKT cell therapeutic strategies. And uh, we announced in January this year that we'd licensed in our interleukin-12 cytokine armoring technology from his group. So we're delighted to have someone of that caliber join our board. And to be clear, he's got, uh, he's both medically, scientifically trained, but has over 200 or more publications uh, and spent uh, the, the last two decades really thinking through sensible strategies to use engineered uh, immune cells for exactly this to target cancer cells. So he has been involved with uh, the research that fed into the the only CAR INKT cell trials that have have been completed uh, worldwide to date. So absolutely phenomenal that we've got him uh, as part of our group on our scientific advisory board. And just a couple of things I think to reiterate on that front. In the INKT cell field itself. Uh, there really are only a handful of companies globally working on INKT cells. And for uh, Australia, we're the only company uh, working on this platform. So to have him uh, bring technologies that also strengthen our platform and also help us to differentiate further in the INKT cell space is a big win for Arabella. So looking forward to working with him. And working initially in the area, in the indication of non-Hodgkin's lymphoma, uh, that's a big opportunity for our Arabella. Yes, it is. Absolutely. So it's in the order of about 80,000 patients each year in the US are diagnosed with a CD19 positive non-Hodgkin's lymphoma or something of that nature. So it is a big market um, and we still have not yet seen uh, the approval of an allogeneic cell therapy targeting this indication. And that's that's a big focus for Arabella and utilising our INKT cell platform. So certainly looking forward to taking this into clinic and then uh, getting data to support that. Good to see you this morning. Michael, thanks for your time on Just Docs. Thank you, Andrew. Appreciate it.